Supporters of the murdered schoolgirl, including biological mother Cindy Palmer, were at Beanley Courthouse to hear what happened to her. She had her ups and downs, that, like any kid really. But it's, one of, yeah, it's just a shame that it's come to this, really. Foster brother Trent Vorburn was charged with incest and perjury. The court hearing he was worried he might have made the 12-year-old pregnant before she was allegedly murdered by his father. The prosecution described his behaviour throughout the investigation as misleading, fabricating and outright lied to the police. Lawyer John Ide argued the 19-year-old would not be a risk if released on bail due to his lack of criminal history. Tia's friends and family held each other as the magistrate denied bail, ruling he'd present an unacceptable risk. It was a relief. It, uh, yeah, it's fantastic news for the whole family. Foster father Rick Forbin, 56, has been charged with Tia Lee's murder. He was due to appear in the same court, but is in an induced coma in hospital after collapsing in custody yesterday. His wife, Julene, and other son, Josh Twenny, have been charged with perjury and attempting to pervert the course of justice. Rick Forbin will remain in custody until the new court date of December 21st, where he will be facing charges for murder. Liana Walker, QUT News.